What is going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I have something pretty epic and that is our first look at an Osiris weapon, that being a Pulse Rifle. But before we go any further guys, I am giving away a Rockstar Destiny 2 in-game exclusive gear code. To win one, simply drop a like on this video and leave a comment. Okay, so thanks to Hardcore Gamer, whose channel can be found linked within the video description, we have some fresh new footage of Destiny 2 and the European Dead Zone. And the footage over on their channel shows many new things, but today I want to talk about the pick of the bunch. Let's start. Take a look at this weapon. How amazing does this thing look for damn sure? Now if we didn't know any other wiser, seeing this weapon you would straight up think this is a Trials of Osiris Pulse. Yeah for sure that's what it seems to be, but actually in my opinion this is not a Trials weapon at all and here's why I think this. Firstly Trials of the Nine has been teased a lot, Trials of the Nine would also make a great addition to the game. Yesterday we saw the PlayStation trophies dropped on the cyberwebs, uh, which also points and hints towards the Nine. But then you are thinking, what's this weapon and why is it themed around Trials of Osiris? Well let me explain, Osiris being the key word here, Trials of, let's forget about that part. Most of us who bought Destiny 2 bought it with both expansion packs, why wouldn't you? If you look at expansion pack 1, which is due out before this year ends. Its symbol, you guessed it, is Osiris. So we will be getting DLC based around Osiris in some way or another. And this weapon, in my opinion, is definitely a part of that DLC. It has to be, it makes more sense, it truly does. But let's have another look at it in more detail. The thing is incredible in design, it truly is. Hopefully weapons in Destiny 2 are more designed around uh, that which they represent and ain't just reskins as we're used to in Destiny 1. When ADS with this weapon you actually see a sun symbol burning away below the sights which is a great addition. But another great addition to this weapon is the Scarab logo under the sights. I am loving that for sure. In all honesty I can actually see this weapon being an exotic obtainable for doing a quest which comes with the first DLC for Destiny 2. I mean if we look at the weapon's design it screams exotic in many many ways. Might not be the case for sure but it does seem that way. But what do you think about the idea I've put forward today? Do you indeed think as I do and believe this will be related to the DLC come the end of the year? Or do you think something else? Let me know down below. But guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks as always for stopping by. If you're new around here and enjoy Daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. And I will as always guys, catch you on that next one.